All right, hey guys, um, welcome to a um, video tutorial that I'm going to show you. I'm going to be showing you how to um, re um, how to like compress your videos the fastest and like the best. So what I use, I use um, Fraps to record all the um, all my gameplay and stuff, and then I send it to um, this thing, Camtasia Studios, which I can like put all the videos together and like edit it and stuff and then produce it and then when I do that it turns uh, so I got it, it makes it really big it makes it like four uh, four gigabytes so that's like a lot you don't really want to upload that right so you need to compress your videos to make them smaller so what I've got here are three um, uh, three different programs that can compress your videos and I'm going to show you which one's the best so first one right here is Easy H264 this is like when if you like Google how to like compress your videos this is one that comes up a lot and this is what it looks like it's very simple um, you just select the video file that you want to do and then you select where you want it this is what you, that you want to compress and you select where you want it to be and then you, you want to see if you want HD, if you want 360p, 720p. So 720p is probably the best. Um, so I have the outcome. So I did um, all I I did all three of these. So regular um, FTB. Uh, episode 9 basically was 5 gigabytes with the uh, Easy H264 or Ajax it is also what it's called it came out to be around four, 465 megabytes it says down here if you can't really see it kind of small um, so yeah that's uh, that one's pretty good but it isn't the best uh, Virtual Dub on the other hand this one is pretty good um, it, uh, you have to save your video files as AVI for it to work and the best thing to do is when you select your video say you want uh, this video you have to um, go to compression and then you have to download a program called XVID and then it should show up here and you click OK and then you save it as AVI again and then it should um, it should compress, and then that made it uh, that made it 448 megabytes, which is a bit better. But the um, the best thing to do is to uh, use Handbrake. This program I just found out about a little while ago, and it. Um, it compresses it a lot more. It doesn't take too long. Like the um, the Easy H two six four that took around half an hour to finish. Virtual Dub took takes about ten minutes, and Handbrake takes about fifteen minutes, depending on like the size of your video. So this one takes a bit longer, and it's a little bit more confusing. But basically, all you have to do is drag your file in here. And then this basically says you need an output file. So make sure you find a, um, where you want your video to go. So, oops. You want it, so I have saved all my videos in here. So I already saved it here, handbrake. So then you just click OK or save. Make a title, of course. And then I find the best I like I looked it up on YouTube and then it said the best thing to do was to make this constant quality for if you want gameplay make it 22 because this is basically um, makes it like uh, if you're like moving constantly like in Minecraft when you're like turning a lot it makes it so that it's more um, it's not as like fuzzy when you're turning around and then you make uh, reference frames for and then you click start and then it should go and I've already done this yes um, and it turns out to be 
Oh uh, yeah, let me just delete that. Whoopsies. Um, turns out to be uh, 336 megabytes, so that one's a lot faster, a lot better. Well, it's not faster, but it makes it a lot smaller, which is good for um, uploading to YouTube, because the smaller the file, the easier it is to upload. So yeah, those are just some options that you can use uh, uh, to compress your videos. Um, the links will be in the description, and uh, thanks for watching.